What is happening, heroes? Three and here of time here presenting you with another vanilla double scoop. I am here all by my lonesome again. There is an iron golem floating into the lava, and I'm fishing a squid. I don't know why. It sounded like a good idea at the time. Let's go for a boat ride, squid. Come on. Oh, go that way. Come on. Ah, oh, it broke. I was doing some fishing, caught a few fish before I got started. I haven't AFK'd by the iron farm at all. I also haven't finished it. I'm going to do that after this episode, I almost promise. <laughs> uh, this episode, it's going to be a short one because all we're going to do is work on the house. Um, Matt is going to join us again at some point, guys. I promise. I really do. He's coming eventually. <laughs> He's coming. Anyway, we're going to work on the house. So it's going to be a whole lot of, of cutting around. I'm not going to like finish it or anything, it's going to be a long time, but I'm going to do at least another layer, maybe two layers, depends on if I have enough time, uh, we'll see. So uh, I'll show you what I'm going to do, but as you guys have already experienced, it gets hard to talk during it. So, Alright, so here's how it's going to go, it's pretty simple, just like this, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. And I'm going to get my bushes handy dandy. You know what? Maybe building out like that is a bad idea, actually. Hmm. Not sure. What do you guys think? Huh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so. That's that. And then this needs to come forward one. Hmm. Should have brought shears. Then be like one, two, three, four. Five, two, three. All right, so this is gonna take a lot of concentrating. You see what I'm doing though? It's it's gonna oh, oh. it's gonna be going out now at this point, um, and around. So it's expanding out. Uh, it's oh boy. Okay. <laughs> uh, <coughs> excuse me. It's gonna be seven layers. Um, but the the middle layer, so like the fourth layer, is going to be not there. And you'll see why in a while. So I'm going to build a little bit of it, and I'll show you guys when I'm done. Alright guys, so here's what I got so far. Not much, but <laughs> I have half of a layer. It's taken me like... Ah! I was looking away. Oh my gosh, every time I talk to you guys, I fall off. It took me about 15 minutes to do that. It's a lot of counting, man. You lose track and you get distracted. It's very rough. But, alas. I'd probably do more layers off camera, but I'm going to keep going. This isn't it. Uh, as you probably know already by the time of the video. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to try to build the rest of this layer and maybe one more layer this video. It would be nice if I could do all three, though. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to do all three because... I'll build all three on video, and then I'll build the bottom three off video, because the bottom three are the same exact as the top three, and then uh, next time you see it, it'll just be not done, but you get the idea. You'll see soon. Alright guys, so here's what I got so far. It's looking pretty good. It won't it won't look completely good until we put the fine details on. Right now it's all just the structure. 
Just a reminder, you know. Um, let me put some torches down. I got blown up by a creeper at one point. It may or may not be in the video. Who knows? I haven't decided yet. Um, yeah, so I'm going to light up all this real quick. Uh, my computer's being laggy all of a sudden. Now that I'm talking to you guys, it was good the whole time until now. Makes sense. <clears throat> um, I want to light the top of this, but it won't have to be lit for very long because we do actually have a lighting plan for this. So. Uh, I know it looks like it's just a big, dark, snowy building, but we do have a light plan. Believe it or not, it goes in with the aesthetics of the exterior design. We have quite nifty exterior design planned, as a matter of fact. It will be quite nice. So, um, I think from here the iron farm does not render in it. Like, it doesn't function from this far away. I think I'm too far for it to function, so... Unless I'm, I think maybe on that end it would. But so here's what we got right now. We got these three layers, this, the roof, and then here's the, basically what will be the ceiling is this. And then this is like the first layer inside. Okay. And then below it will be the second layer inside. Below that will be the la uh, third and last layer inside. Then there's the floor. Then there's the like foundation. All four of those guys literally just spawned in front of me. Ah, uh, so what I'm gonna do is off camera. I'm gonna uh, replicate that down there. So hopefully next episode when we come back, that will be down there. It didn't take that long. Um, I had to keep making runs for snow on my snow machine. Um, I think we're gonna have to do something else this episode though, because I doubt that this had anything had more than a few minutes of footage in it. So we're gonna go find something else to do. But uh, these three layers of snow will become the same bottom layers they'll be exactly the same so there's no reason in me making a whole another episode for that or uh, including that in this episode um and hopefully the iron farm will also be done by the next time we see one another let's go see if it uh worked at all while we've been here i haven't afk'd at all i might leave my guy afk'd for a while but i haven't really been worrying about afking since the farm's not built but i guess it wouldn't hurt i'd still get like i think i'll still get like 60 an hour right now something like that a pretty small number until i get them together it gets you i don't know what the exact output is i think it's like 200 per hour so if i leave my guy afk overnight it would be um uh, quite a bit 1600 or something like that depending on how long i sleep i guess <laughs> maybe 2400 <laughs> there we go we got a little bit and that's like from me not even being here so um i haven't done anything uh, I haven't even put the villagers, I wanted to put water in there to keep them in the middle, but I don't think I did that yet. Let's see. Yeah, I tried to do it, but I messed it up, and so I just stopped because I wanted to record. <laughs> so that's what happened there. Um, So I don't know what we're going to do. We, I don't really have any plans. We're going to keep it short, like I said, but let's go look around a little bit. It's hard to plan stuff right now because everything we're going to build goes in the house. So um, we got to get the house done and start getting it progressed. And we can start multiple projects in the house. Um, but it's going to be a while. It's going to be a while for the house is ready to even start hosting projects. But once we have the house project ready, we'll be able to start multiple projects so we can change it up each episode. But uh, next episode, I won't build the house. I don't know. Maybe we'll go on an adventure next episode. I don't know what else we could do. Chicken farm is running good. Yeah, you guys are doing good. Let's check it out. Yeah, they're doing fine. Cows are doing good. Wheat is doing good. Uh, you know what? Let's go have some fun, guys. Alright, we're going to go do something fun. Just for the heck of it, we're going to go get some wither skulls. If we can, that is. Uh, we're going to go with our skull hunting. Because you know what? We have free time. I don't have a looting sword on me. I use this to mark the lines up there. You may have seen it. may have not. Uh, let me put some stuff away. And then we're going to go with our farm. With our farm hunting. We're going to make a wither farm. No, not today. Uh, I think it'll take a long time to make a wither farm. So there's no harm in going ahead and getting at least one beacon before that. Uh, let's take Let's take this bow with us. Let's go ahead and leave this pickaxe here. Might as well leave. Oh, well, we can take the shovel. No need to take the axe. No, wait, I need to take a pickaxe. 
Here we go. Then I'll leave some snow. In here. Then I'll grab some arrows. Alright, I don't have very many arrows. I wonder if I have any flint and steel. Or flint, not flint and steel. <laughs> not flint and steel. Okay, why did you throw the arrows? Alright, let's see. Do we have any feathers? We should, because we have a whole chicken farm. There we go. Um, I need to get some more wood. That would be good. <laughs> I'm going to throw it. What do you know? Uh, let's keep a couple of those for flint and steel or anything else like that. I'm so organized, guys. I can't wait till we have our auto sorter. I have a plan for the auto sorter. You guys have already seen it. But uh, let's talk ideas, too, while we're at it. Because I need some good ideas, all right? Because I've never done something like... Like, I've done, like, an automatic item sorter where you put something in and then it resorts it. But you gotta realize what I'm planning is, like, a large scale utilizing something like this. But I'm gonna compact this and I'm gonna make the departure, like, the filling station work better. So I... The house... Okay, I can explain it to you real quick. Um, let's go look at the house real quick. So the house is that big thing, alright? And this is just the basic part of the house. Um, I still want to see if you guys can guess what it is, but uh, for now, I'll leave it be. Um, this is the basic part of the house. Now, as we keep building, there's going to be a large structure in the middle of it. Uh, nothing is going to touch the ground. This is how high off the ground basically everything is going to be. Some some parts might get lower, but there's basically in the middle, there's going to be a... Uh, let's get on top of the house. You know what? I always build up to the top of the house. I just realized the chicken farm goes up to the top of the house. In the middle, there will be like a three-story structure. Um, that'll take a while to build. Um, and then there's going to be like platforms coming off. And the platforms is where we're going to have like our village, our farms. But the middle is where we're going to have like our like living quarters, like our bedroom, our storage room, and something else. I don't remember. Originally, I was planning to build this house in factions. And so there's going to be a lot of useful places for useful things. But I don't remember what the other room... I've changed its plan. I have it all written down somewhere. So I have a paper where I drew it all out. So this is all really planned out. So it's going to be pretty dope. I hope you guys like it so far. It looks really cool from here. Yeah, it looks crazy. And th this doesn't even have the aesthetics on it right now. It's just bright white right now. We're adding other details to it as we go. So if you just think it's going to be that a big white circle up in the air, you're wrong. There's going to be other aspects to it. We just haven't done it yet. Um, I'm going to wait and talk to Matt about it because uh, we do have a plan. We have another world where we've basically practiced a section, where we've made a small section of the building incomplete. Um, but before I start building it, of course, I want to make sure that Matt is down with it. What is taking so long? Okay, we might want our sword out. I do not know what is happening. Okay, are we good? Yeah, but um, I don't want to start working on that until me and Matt are definitely sure we're good with the design. As well as the interior design, we've worked on that. But we're not completely finalized on it. Our interior design is a little trippy, so <laughs> you guys are going to be weirded out. Uh, it's going to be a little non-traditional interior design. It's going to be pretty crazy. I think it'll be awesome, though. All right, so let's go wither skull hunting just for a little bit. Um, this could be like something we end our episodes with occasionally because wither skull hunting is so slow. Okay, now I have to fight pigs. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> Because one time I came when when I was having the problems with I was having problems with the server glitching when I would come into the Nether, and I guess one of the times it glitched and caused me to hit a zombie pigman, and ever since then my life has been difficult, <laughs> very difficult. I think I've been here before. Yeah, I've already been down here. Hi pigs. I don't think these pig the pigs in this area are mad at me. I get, think they get mad at you by chunk or something like that or you kill all the ones yeah so you can see I've locked up all around here I had many fights I don't know if you guys were with me for that or not I doubt it let's put that there and let's put that there okay he's not aggroed on us so that's good Ok, 
Okay, I can't tell if he's coming for us or not. I'm going to leave him alone in case he's not. Don't want more pigmen to worry about. Okay, he's like running all over the place, making me nervous. Ooh, diamond. Nice. Okay, that pigment's got me freaked out. I'm not gonna lie, that little little baby pigment. <laughs> Let's grab that XP as well. Doing a little nether adventure, and that's all, guys. Hey, piggy. Good pig name. Uh, saddles. Saddles are good. We're definitely gonna have uh stable somehow in our base. I don't know. The stable might have to be on the ground. We do have like some ground connections. That's why we built our home into the mountain there. It's all good. <laughs> it is going to be somewhat connected to the ground. There's going to be elements like the the stables probably. I don't know how we could arrange to have a stable in the air. If you have an idea for that, a floating stable, how could we make the stables up in the sky with the rest of our base and still be able to access the horses? Like get them down to the ground. I mean, then again, you kind of just end up with your horses for show most of the time in Minecraft. I mean, I don't hardly ever end up using them when I have a stable and stuff like that, but... I don't know, they end up being more trouble than they're worth. Okay, please don't hit a pig with your bow. Okay. Don't aggro me, pigman. We're friends. He's spinning. I'm hoping he'll come after me. Come at me, bro. Cool. Not exactly what we want. <laughs> okay. Stop shooting at me. <laughs> Alright. Uh, this is the chest we already got, right? Definitely. Okay, we got all kinds of stuff shooting at us. Great. Nailed it. Alright. Oh boy. Uh oh. Oh, okay, I did not deflect that at all. <laughs> oh, yeah, the combat. <laughs> I love PvE combat. I don't know. It's better than PvP for some reason. It's more satisfying, I think. More frustrating, too. Okay, let's just not go for that. Dude, this is the day. We're going to get a Wither Skull right now. Come on, boy. Come on down. Hey. Um, let's see. I want to get up to him. Hmm. Give me an idea. If we can just get up to this part, we'll be okay. I want it to be redoable though. Come on, come get me. Why are you just dancing? Dude, I did not do it, pig. It was not me, I swear. I swear. Okay, he dropped bones. You need to die. Die! Uh. Holy cow, there's a lot of them. Are they mad at me? I feel like they're mad at me. So I'm gonna run. <laughs> okay, so there's more to this fortress. Alright, wait. We need to eat. Don't be mad at me, please. It's okay. I didn't do anything. I swear. It was a blaze. I didn't attack your friends. Please stop growling at me. Please stop. <laughs> Just stop it. It's unnecessary. Okay. 
previous ones and died in two hits. Not cool. Alright, we're getting stuff, guys. We don't really need nether war. I have some at home already. I've already made potions, so. Shut up, pigs! Yeah. <laughs> More saddles. All the saddles. We'll be all have a lot of horses at this point. Don't attack me. It's okay. We're friends. I think when I go if I leave here and come back, like they'll be mad at me. Like they'll take out their aggression on the blazes on me. On the with the blazes, whatever words. Die. Die. Okay, can't make that jump because it's listen. I want their experience. I hate to tell you. I need thirty. You need to make a sword so that I can actually loot these guys. I don't think we're going to get a wither skull today, I guess. I'm having fun killing things in the nether, though. How exciting. Huh. No, nothing. Hmm. Ooh, let's get him. A lot of magma cream. Ooh, lots of blazes, too. I don't like that blazes spawn just randomly in the fortresses now. I liked it when they only spawned by spawners. Because they're the hardest part of the nether. Forget the wither skeletons. See as they float towards me. Get scumbags. Ooh, I'm dead. I refuse to be dead. I refuse to be dead. Wish you could make a magma cream farm. I don't know if they have spawn chunks or not. I don't really think there's a need for magma cream farm, it's just cool. I tried to make like a magma cream catching pit once, like when I first started playing Minecraft. But like they would jump so high out of that thing. Okay, you're dead. Boy, this is the least wither skull skeletons I've ever seen. The one time I actually like go looking for them. I'm not finding any. So sad. The nether looks a lot better, I think. I don't know. I haven't decided. I don't like the nether rack that much. It definitely looks better than the vanilla nether rack, but... Uh, I think the nether does look better. It looks almost the same when you look off in the distance, but it looks slightly more eerie. With, like, the weird block texture. Not, like, the dotted blocks. Minecraft could do better with their textures. I hope you guys like my texture pack. It's really nice. I like it. Hmm. There are other fortresses we can go to. Okay, they congregate on top of roofs, it seems like. Bring it. Bring it, buddy. Bring it! Bring it! Get wrecked! Okay, they're all dead. He dropped the sword, he dropped some coal, they both dropped some XP. What'd you drop? Wither skull! Wither skull! I know there's a wither skull down there. I think I checked this chest. Yes. Okay, that guy didn't drop anything. He just dropped experience. They were on top of this roof for some reason. Time to investigate what led them to be on such a terrible place, unreachable by sort of human people. I don't know, are Minecraft characters humans? I don't think so. What race are they? What race? Or maybe you design your own race. Maybe it's like a, an RPG or something. And you choose your race in Minecraft. I guess you do because you're skin. What race is Steve, you know? And the new one, the 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 other person now. Come here, wither, wither guy. Oop, okay, he's coming. <laughs> They're not very hard with the bow, but of course, to do anything to them with looting, I would need a sword. Okay, come on in. Okay. Got him. Blazes tear you up, man. Cause like you're not even like worried about them. They just 
Put the herd on yard. Die. All right. I think we're leaving the nether. I need a good looting sword. It's almost pointless if I don't have one. I'm just wasting uh, wither skeletons. So let's go on home. And I don't know. I don't know how high of a level we need for looting. We can look real quick. But then we'll we'll stop this episode. We've been here for a while. And yeah. We already built. We did so many things. I've been playing for a long time. I just wanted to keep playing. I am going to keep playing after this. I'm going to work on the house and the iron farm. I don't know which one I should work on. I guess I should work on the iron farm first. Yeah. Probably. That's what I'll do. Alright. So let's go home real quick. Why are you looking at my house, buddy? I'm here. Right here. There, you did. <laughs> Alright, so this is it for the episode, guys. Please let me know what you think of the home so far. Um, give me some ideas for the horse stable. Could I make a horse stable in the air? Is there a way like, to get the horses down without looking stupid? Otherwise, I'm going to keep the horses like in the mountain. And it will still look good. We'll find a good way to do it, I promise. Alright. That's it for today, guys. Seize your destiny, strike subscribe, and become a hero today. See ya.